Hey everyone, it's me Garen Singh, bringing you a brand new series guys. I've decided to cancel Road to Archie now and move on to another series. It's called Road to 88 Suarez. Yeah, 8 to, to Liverpool's Luis Suarez. Basically this is a series where I'll be building a Liverpool team and, you know, and make and trying to get Suarez. And, I'll, and to do that I'll be um, doing a lot of Ultimate Team matches and a, mix, and a bit of trading as well. So yeah, I'm not the best at trading, I'll admit. But um, I'm still quite decent. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm not very good at it. So this will be a good series for me to learn. And also to help you guys who aren't good at it. I will watch this. But anyway, guys, this is my starter pack. Start building. And yeah, we get a few Premier, we get a Premier League player in here. We get um, Gutierrez from Norwich. Newly transferred. He's on loan, isn't he, from Newcastle. But yeah. So yeah, guys. Um, what do you think about this series? Let me know in the comments below. Yeah. And yeah. And also, guys, as it is EA's fifth anniversary, but as at the time I recorded this episode, even when you create a new account, you get fry five free packs, as you can see here, to celebrate years fan anniversary. I'm gonna open them and I'll admit guys, I use some of these players in the team. You know, when I start building it to make the Liverpool team. And um yeah, if you guys don't think I should do that, but I, I don't mind, um let me know in the comments below. So and I won't use them in future episodes, but I'm just using it for this episode. But if you don't if no one comments or you comment saying you don't mind then that's fine, yeah fine by me but just let me know yeah but anyway guys yeah um i'm not gonna be going for the really expensive informs like all the inform suarez is and you know the inform gerard and all that um i will go for informs that are cheap like henderson for example skirtle but not expensive ones it's basically, basically the thing is once i get to suarez 88 rated that's the end of the series and it will be quite a long time because i'm not very good at trading but um and also another thing guys if you know any good trading tips that you want to share let me know because it would help me a lot and yeah and not 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 trading that would die down, but you know trading that's permanent, you know. But let me know in the comments below, and I'll happily do that. But anyway, guys, opening these packs. I think this is the third one now. Who are we gonna get? Who are we gonna get Milner. Oh, we've got no Liverpool players in these packs. I'll just say it there, unfortunately. But oh well. But yeah, anyway, guys. Um, I hope you like the idea of this new series, and um, obviously, and also, guys, comment below um for the next episode. Tell me what players you want me to buy. Liverpool players obviously because it's basically a Liverpool team but you know I mean but you know we won't be doing trading yet we'll probably do that l much later on and we've got a new transfer to Armero and we've got a Barbo see it's a sign EA want me to sweat now I'm just <laughs> but um yeah we won't be starting trading yet like these first few episodes will just be me building a team and once we've got a full Liverpool team going I'll start doing trading and also when I have enough coins to buy some other players as well so anyway to the last rare gold pack we get for free who are we going to get Poyo and Pizarro. Hmm, not amazing. We've got Armero again, but we have to quick sell him because we really got him as a duplicate and we can't sell them because they're untradeable, which really sucks, but yeah. <laughs> and also guys, um oh yeah, um last week I did a pack opening on my main channel of these free packs and it got over a thousand views and that is absolutely insane. no, that's absolutely sensational and amazing. Thanks a lot, guys. That means so much. And I've got a few more subscribers as well. 14 now from 10. Thank you, guys. I appreciate all the comments. Tell me of all the good players you got in your packs. And um, kind of jealous because someone got informed, Gerald. I would have loved to have that because, you know, I'm a little fan, obviously, and I'm doing this series. <laughs> but, um, you know, but yeah. But anyway, guys, uh, before we get into the game, we have enough coins. We have 500 coins to start. We have enough coins to buy. Yago Aspas. Yago Aspas. And, yeah, he's a pretty good goal. He has four-star skills. He's got good, decent pace, 81 pace. He's got good dribbling and he's got he's got good shot on him as well. But unfortunately, guys, I think next year he'll be a silver on FIFA 15 because you know he hasn't had the best of seasons this season. Like um, at the start of the season, he was starting a lot when Suarez was suspended. You know for his bat about about but when Suarez came back, Aspas has not been in the team that much. He hasn't even scored in the league yet. He's only scored in the FA Cup against Oldham. But um, to be fair to him, it is quite hard when he's playing when he's trying to compete with arguably the best team. The, no, the best strikers in the Premier League. Like, Suarez is the best striker in the world. I'm not being biased there. Sturridge, he's not the best. I think Aguero is better, but Sturridge is still amazing. You know, but at the moment, based on form, because Aguero is injured, I think he's quite good. But anyway, guys, into the first game of this. We're going to, straight into Division, guys. First game, Division 10. Come against a team called Sanwell County. And he's got Robert Lewandowski up front. And he's got Ferdinand. He's got Bartra, Barcelona centre-back. And yeah, but anyway, guys, straight away... Um, 
to give away a corner. I didn't know that came off me. Could have done. And he has a corner here. Janino takes it. And Ferdinand, out of all the people, the camel, the cocaine drug dealer. No, I'm joking. Ferdinand <laughs> heads the ball in to make it 1-0 to him. Oh, crap. But anyway, guys, here we're in here with Dawson. Dawson has a shot. Smashes it. Keeper saves. And then we have a corner. So now it's time for us to in Zach in mark our uh, embark our revenge on him man we're gonna score a corner against him as well boom his keeper comes out in nowhere's land in no man's land and immobile i think his name is immobile he's a dali and immobile but yeah he scores a header from a corner to make it one all then we get the boy that aspat aspat just does some dazzling stuff makes Fernand look silly Out outpaces bartra left footed finish into the back of the net to make it 2-1 to us that's a quick turnaround 10 minutes in i'll just say here guys first this is a very very um, amazing game like a, a thriller it's a massive high scoring game and let's hope we get on the good side of it but anyway we're 2-1 up 10 minutes gone that's quite good anyway still 10 minutes in he gets the ball intercepts the ball here and um, he puts it into Lewandowski Lewandowski is too strong and too quick for my bronze defenders smacks the ball past my keeper to make it 2 all. so and that was a really good finish by him I admit but it's quite hard to handle Lewandowski he has another corner here Lewandowski headers it in to make it 3-2 so yeah guys as you know corners are bullshit in FIFA 14 they're so overpowered and ridiculous head in is as well you know and then he has another chance here I think no his players in I, I hack him I was last man and I was just fearing what the ref was going to give me and yeah he gave me a red card Garat got sent off for a bad challenge it was a red card because it was a goal scoring opportunity as well because he was in but anyway yeah he has a corner from that free kick and Ferdinand has the ball here and yeah he does a really nice finisher to the back of the net. You know, you know, he failed. A, he hasn't turned up for a drugs test, but he turns up for me for, for this guy. No, I'm joking. <laughs> and then just before half time, we quickly pull back another goal. MB was in. He's a really good player. Has a shot. Good goal. 3 2. We're back in the game. That's just the lifeline we needed before half time. So that's brilliant. And yeah, I don't know what I was doing there. But anyway, it's half time. We're drawing. No, we're losing 3 4 to. Sanwell County and yeah and I'm, about to, and I'm down to 10 men but three months on FIFA being down 10 men doesn't really mean anything but seeing the stats there this guy should be winning by more he's absolutely dominating me but we're still in it and that's the main thing the yeah, innit right at the start of the second half he makes some subs he brings on Diego Costa and Isco and another guy who I don't know but flipping it I think so, oh my god I'm getting my work cut out today but luckily for me this guy was shit at FIFA as in like he didn't know how to play with them. But anyway, then Calero makes it 4 all. Yes, yeah, 4 all. And yeah, and then right at the end, guys, we put in Dawson. Dawson, can he can he say, finish it? Yes, he can. He has scored a 90th minute to give us the 5-4 win. It's amazing. Absolutely brilliant. I'm over the moon at that. Losing 4-2. And I come back to win 5-2 in the last minute. And Dawson finally gets his goal. Because remember, he missed um, when we scored our first goal from a corner. You know. Oh, but yeah, anyway, yeah, right at the end when I was trying to waste time, my striker immediately got sent off for a really dirty challenge. Look at this. <laughs> yeah, it's a red card. But anyway, guys, we won 5 4. We were down to nine men, but we won, and that's what counts. Yeah. First three points in Division 10. That is brilliant. And we just need three more wins to get promoted, and then we'll have 2K, and we'll, and we'll get the title, and then we'll have 2K to be able to get loads of players well buy quite a few cheap local players but yeah as you can see on the stats there he should have won maybe but i think my defending was all right but yeah anyway three points Woo! but yeah anyway guys because our players are spending we're gonna put in some of our players we got from those um five free packs and like i said guys um let me know in the comments below is it all right if i use these players i got in those three five packs i got or if you're not if you don't agree with it then i won't do it in the next and i won't put them in the next episode but yeah they won't be here for long anyway because um what do you call it? Um, I'll be making, hopefully I'll have a full Liverpool team done. Maybe about the fifth episode, hopefully. I'll try to do as much already in the road to Argentina. Try and get at least quite a few up a week. You know what I mean? But um, I'm going home this weekend, guys. So I won't be able to do any videos until... Um, I'll be back on Monday, though. So don't worry about that. But yeah. Anyway, we're coming on to this team. 4 3 has got a player that we need. Raheem Sterling. Yeah. And then in, right in the 30th minute near there, Aspas does some really good footwork. Gets past everyone. Has a shot with his left foot and makes it 1-0. Aspas, guys, if you want a cheap striker in lower divisions who's a beast, get Aspas. Aspas is very good. He's decent. And I hope in real life he does score a goal for Liverpool soon. <laughs> oh. But yeah, in real life, I think he's alright. He's not 
shit. Actually, he kind of is. But um, you need to give him a chance. You know, he doesn't have that much opportunities in front of him. You know, I think we'll keep him, hopefully. Anyway, we've we'll crossed the ball here. Aspas is on the end of it again to make it 2 0 right before half time. So that is really good. 2 0 up. Hopefully, we can get our next win. And yeah, we're w half time is 2 0. Yeah, Aspas double. I think obviously the first goal was the best one. But yeah, looking at the stats here, I very I clearly deserve it. I've, maybe my shots on target have been quite poor because I've had seven shots and only three on target. But we're doing all right. But anyway, into the second half. You know, Pellini has the ball here, gives the ball to Aspas. Aspas is in. He's in. A go on, on his right. Outside the foot was left. Boom. 3 0. Aspas has got his treble, his hat trick. Anyway, now we have another chance here. Polino gives it to Milner. Milner gives it to Gutierrez. Gutierrez squares it for Aspas to make it 4 0. In my opinion, that was a good team goal. All right, That was a sweaty goal. But in real life, if you scored a goal like that, that would be good because all the passing and all that. That would be a goal Barcelona would be happy with. You know, And we've got a trophy perfection. Yeah, and then right at the end, Sterling's in for him. He chips my keeper and scores. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm liking the looks of Sterling. I might buy him. Yeah, obviously I'm gonna buy him. But yeah, I don't know why he randomly paused it. But anyway, um, he held on and uh, well, I held on and we won 4-1 in our second game. That is absolutely brilliant. And yeah, guys, I'd like to say, I'm sorry this episode is quite long. But um, if you don't mind, I'll keep it this long. But if you want it to be short, I'll make about eight or seven minutes long. You know, I just did it because it's an introduction episode. You know what I mean? Anyway, guys, we're gonna buy two more players now. We're gonna buy. Jordan Henderson, my favourite little player at the moment. I think he is so underrated in real life. Like, well, he's starting to get the form he deserves, recognition. And then we get another centre mid, one I don't like at all, Joe Allen for Liverpool. Um, I just don't like him in real life. I think he's rubbish. <laughs> well, I think he's all right, but he's just, uh, I just don't like him. I really don't. Obviously, I wish him the best. Obviously, yeah, he's had some good games recently against Man United. He played very well, but against Cardiff, he was very rubbish to be honest they weren't that good but anyway we're putting Henderson and Allen at CDMs because they will get full chemistry once the full Liverpool team is built because they'll all get green links and we'll also buy the manager Brendan Rodgers as well yeah do that as well but anyway guys into the third and final match can we get promoted can we yeah I hope so anyway we're against a team called Stockport FC he has got Jackson Martinez and Palacio up front he's got Yepes at the back with Silvestro I think that's all the players I really know to be honest but yeah anyway into the game here. Gutierrez has a chance. He gets brought down. And I'm sorry, but that is a penalty all day long. You know. Yepes, I'm sorry, mate. You're so slow, but yeah. Anyway, we're going to get the penalty to oh, the one and only Yago Aspas. Who else are we going to give it to? And uh, are we going to score? The pressure's on. He goes left. Oh, yes. Just luckily the ball. The keeper went the right way, but the, he went low and I went. I smashed it and up. And there, I made it 1-0 with Yago Ass. Look at that. Keep went the right way, but it was too high for him. What a finish. What a penalty. Well, Aspas in real life, but he has taken penalties before. Went for Celta Vigo. But yeah, anyway, now, right after that, Polinio puts Yago Aspas in. We tackle that defender there, and he has a slots the ball with a finesse shot past the keeper to make it 2-0. Aspas got another brace on him. Could he get another hat trick? We'll see. Anyway, just before half time, he has the ball here with Palacio, just runs down the wing, holds off Allen because Allen is weak. <laughs> and he does a nice pass here, and James absolutely smashes it into the top right corner. I mean, what a goal that was. Who is that guy? Is that. I don't even know. I need to search this guy. M. James. Flipping heck, that was a brilliant goal from him. But yeah, anyway, half time with 2 1, one 2 up, or 2 1 up. I hope we can hold on to this win. Like, he's down to 10 men. I should, I should be able to get the win here. You know, but that's a nice goal there by Aspas. This guy wasn't skipping it for some reason. I don't know why. But yeah, you want to see this goal. And who, who can blame him? This was a brilliant goal. Look at that strike. Boom. And yeah, from the stats, I really should be winning by more. That was his only shot of the whole entire half. So yeah, anyway, let's try get another goal. Into the second half we go. Now, Mela has the ball here. Gives it to Aspas. Aspas, Gutierrez. Plays a 1-2 with Aspas. Aspas just smashes it past the keeper to make it 3-1. Right at the start of the second half. And that is a brilliant goal. And hopefully that would ensure our promotion. Yeah. And yeah, guys. That was all what happened. We won 3-1. End of the game. Very comfortable win. Could have won by more. Maybe should have won by more. But yeah. As you know, guys. We've got 9 points now. We've been promoted. We've just another 3 points to win the title and get to Division 9. So let me know, guys, in the comments below what level players I should get when I get that 2k. That's what you get when you win it. But anyway, guys, we're going to buy one more player before we end this episode. We're going to buy the great Dane, Daniel Agger. Daniel Agger, the Danish beast. 
for Denmark. He's been at Liverpool for so long, since 2006. He, 2005, actually. He's a brilliant player. He's a very good player. But, yeah, we brought him. I'm talking about real life. But in this game, he's all right as well. There's quite agar in his team now. And then we're going to end the episode. So, yeah, guys, like I say, I hope you enjoyed this first episode of Road to, Su Road to 88 Suarez. Hope to see you in episode two, which should be out soon. And let me know in the comments below. Is it all right if I stick with these players i got in these five packs? And... Do you like the idea of the series and what other little players should I buy next when I win the title, which hopefully should be in the next episode. So, hope this episode, guys. Take care, and I'll see you later. Bye.